Well, my friends, it is May 21st, 2021, the last day of our stupid freaking lockdown here in Ontario, insofar as boating is concerned, and tomorrow, boating becomes legal again. Woohoo! <laughs> back <laughs> ah so nice yeah as you can see i am back aboard boogaboo um as i was alluding to at the very beginning it was finally 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 announced yesterday afternoon that as of tomorrow marinas will be open to the general public again who freaking ha huh, about bloody time you have no idea how frustrating that's been for uh, myself in particular, and of, uh, of course, Anchor Girl as well. Just because the entire government's been, just been playing games and hinting and maybe and perhaps and possibly, but clearly there was a lot of pressure on them and they just finally said, you know what, we'll open marinas, golf courses, tennis courts. Who the hell plays tennis? But anyways, so they've done that for our greater good. Hoo-ha. So like I say, that goes into effect tomorrow. So it would be like midnight tonight. But you know what? I ducked out of work today. Took the day off. And I am going to get this boat ready. Water. It needs a wash desperately. And of course, everything inside is uh, got all the winter grime on it. So I'm going to get going on that right now. I don't know how much I'm going to be checking back in with you. I hope periodically but I gotta get this boat going it is it's really dirty <laughs> and I'm happy about that because I get to clean it hoo-ha I just do want to show you something real quick inside here if I may my cap my sunglasses <sighs> hold on hold on Yeah, I've told you this in the past, but it is so good to come back on the boat after a long time. And just that smell, the smell of the boat, it smells so clean, irrespective of the fact that it's a, a disheveled mess in here. And also the other thing I want to show you was smiling again. Do you remember the last time we were in here? That was April 17th, I believe the date was. Uh, the date that it was announced that I had to get off the boat and stay off the boat and I've mostly done that <laughs> for the last month but anyways here we are yeah breaking the rules a little bit but don't care um, it's all good so like I say clean up straighten up oh 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 can you see that in this shot um, see the problem is I'm using my DJI pocket 2 camera which is super small let me just show you how small this friggin' thing is. See, I need a mirror. I need a mirror. Hold on. Spin you around. Whoop. See that? Can you see? Can you see that? It's only this big. It's only this big, and this wide. And it has a. Let's come back around. And it's got really a tiny little screen on the thing. And the problem is, my glasses are for distance, so. For me to see that screen, I gotta either do one of these or do one of those. <laughs> and that just looks creepy all the way around. So I'm gonna turn this around slowly and just show you something. I have the cushions reinstalled on the boat. If you remember, I took this off, took, took these home, uh, took this home, took this apart, Anchor Girl washed it really nicely, and then I got new foam. And uh, yeah, that was all done. And I reinstalled those <laughs> a few days ago. So anyways, next thing I'm gonna do is not, not right now, but of course I have to do a video on the new uh, bed sheets and uh, covers and all that that we got from shopyachtbedding.com. 
So that's going to be not part of this video. I'll do that later on. But anyways, okay, Paul, enough freaking talking. Time to get to work on the boogie boo boat, the boogie boo boat. <laughs> oh, stop it. Stop being so happy. It's like Scrooge. I don't deserve to be so happy, but I can't help it. Look at that. Oh, did I mention the boat's in the water and we're floating? Yeah, that happened too. <sighs> so nice. Okay, as you just saw, I had the engines running. I fired them up actually a couple days ago while I was here as well. Um, launch day was on May 19th, if I haven't mentioned that already. So I I came here after hours and fired up the engines to make sure the shore power is on and tied up correctly and all that. It was all good. Boys did a good job. Um, but what I did just discover now is, I'm gonna flip the camera around here. Um, Part of my look through on everything was to uh, run the generator for the first time this season. I'm glad I did. Uh, you won't see it down there, but um, water leakage. So I was hoping against hope that it was just a couple of loose uh, clamps or a loose clamp, but it wasn't. Uh, appears that the shaft seal has gone on that water pump. Now, if you look back in my how I did it uh, videos, you'll see you'll come across a video where i rebuilt that water pump completely <laughs> i can turn this around again yeah so if you recall that video if you want to watch it now um i went all the way through that i i got a rebuild kit for that water pump and changed the seals bearings whatever else that was in there and i went all the way through the instruction come to the very end it said right from westerbeek's own words was um, more or less should have just replaced the entire pump so I'm not gonna fool around with that now because the pump is probably not gonna be that much more than the rebuild kit which was 600 bucks I think if I remember back in the day that was 2017 so that's a number of years ago so I'm not really worried about it and again it'll be just a hell of a lot easier just to swap that out than uh, rebuild it because it's difficult enough just to get down in there so I have emailed um, the uh, local Westerbeek dealer and to see if they got one or how quickly he can get it to me. Yeah, so that's it. Anyways, everyone else, air conditioning's running. I'm just flushing out the water system, the fresh water system right now. I hooked up um, the accessory items back to the house batteries. So they're, they're going. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm happy, I'm happy. So I'm gonna close the engine hatch uh, just flush some more water through the uh, fresh water system and uh, keep cleaning back here and then hopefully I can start putting the carpets back down and uh, yeah that'll be it for today I want to do engine or oil changes again um, before it gets too late and if you remember from a little bit farther back uh, oil change and tune up on the generator as well so I'll probably do that all part and parcel with the water pump replacement uh, so oil changes on the engine engines as well as change the transmission fluid again on both of the transmissions yeah so i'm gonna get back at it beautiful day love it even though i'm not supposed to be here <laughs> Hoo -ha. it is a spentabulous day aboard boogaboo on what i'm calling the first day of summer even though it's only the 21st of may 
and the official first start of summer is exactly one month away today but it is feels like summer it's sunny it's been hot all day and I've been on the boat all day and it has been spectacular so happy to be back on Boogaboo the day before our lockdown ends Boogaboo love it love it love it love it well as you can see I got the uh, dinghy davits extensions on for the extended dinghy davit system that we have and it is looking pretty good here next to the water's edge on what I'm gonna call the first day of summer even though it's not but it is and so hopefully this weekend I will have a chance to bring the actual dinghy over and we will see how that works on boogaboo but I'll wait until it's legal to be back on the boat because we're not even supposed to be here right now. Look at that. Boogaboo. Soon to be boogaboo and dingy doo. <laughs> Hoo ha. Summer is here, my friends. Summer is here. Well, that was a super productive day and got way more done than I was expecting to do. Um, Anchor Girl came by this afternoon as well and did. The thorough cleanup inside. Uh, I was able to wash the whole outside of the boat, which is really nice. Scrub the deck, scrub the swim platform. Got the uh, extended swim or extended dinghy davits uh, set in, in place. So I might bring the dinghy by on the weekend as well and just try it out there. And, you know, just put it on the boat, right? That's what it's here for. Um, yeah, and I think that's about it. Now we're not gonna spend the night here because uh, we got to still. Anchor Girl's got to make the bed. I just got to bring the poo box in that for little tiny. And it's getting late. It's, I don't know, it's going on five o'clock. I've been here all day and it's it's like a work day. <laughs> but a beautiful work day because I've got this great setting. So yes, I did cheers the day with the first Corona light. Anchor Girl had a uh, Schmirnoff ice and we just sipped on it and uh, just said, this is so nice. We we're both getting sleepy and ready to pass out. So, before I got into another one, said we'll call it a day for today. I'm gonna go home, get all uh, charred up, and uh, start bright and early tomorrow morning. And we will be back for the official first full weekend on Boogaboo. Yeah, yeah, really happy. Again, I am. Uh, kind of tired <laughs> I hate to keep saying this but I worked late a few nights uh, not a few nights every night this week and um, super busy at work as always very grateful uh, and just trying to wrap things up so that I could take today off and yeah it's just so relaxing even though I worked here all day I'm not tired from working on the boat I'm just relaxed it's peaceful it's gorgeous can you hear the water lapping on the hulls? It's so nice. So... Oh. <laughs> Anyways, just kidding. So that's it for our first full day on the boat in the water. Again, it's May 21st, 2021. The day before we're legally allowed to be here. How's that? <laughs> Don't tell anybody you saw me here. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to wrap this one up here and I will uh, I will start a new one tomorrow and uh, show you what we get into. Oh, we're going to hoist the dinghy up and we'll, we'll see how that works, amongst other things. So that's it. Again, hoo-ha to the beginning of the season. And uh, yeah, summer 2021 has started now. We'll see you soon. Cheers.